John Dutton will lead things off here in the ninth in what's been a truly forgettable ball game for this home nine and not a very inspiring performance either. And I guess the kicker for me is the way that these guys are responding. It's one thing to go out and get clobbered. It happens, but when you get guys going through the motions, not running out ground balls, not backing up, that's where I take issue. Up next for the Astros. And he'll look at a first pitch curveball that's in the dirt. It's ball one. Chop foul right at home plate. It's strike one. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. Trying to strike him out for the second time. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Martin is there, and there are two men gone now. Alex Presley will stand in here as the 27th and many hope final batter in this masterful performance. Now he lifts a high pop-up, drifting into foul territory on the right side. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Now a swing, and he pops him up, right up the chute. This may be tough behind the plate. And with that, I can finally say the four words I've had on my mind for what seems like an eternity. This ball game is over. But that is absolutely dominant. I mean, what else could you say? 27 up, 27 down. And you know what? This is the first time I've ever witnessed a perfect game. So it's one of the hardest things for a pitcher in the world to do. Probably the hardest. But we were fortunate enough to see it here, guys. A perfect game. One more look at the final line score there to see the great pitching performance that led his guys to the victory. And guys, I think you might agree there's little doubt that the star of this afternoon's contest was this man, Prince Fielder. Take a snapshot of that. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, 